If you're thinking of buying a puppy or even an adult dog, there are many things to learn and consider. Sadly, while the Poodle is probably one of the most recognized dogs in the world, many people still think of this breed as being one that barks a lot and does not like children but nothing could be further from the truth. We have made this video to dispel these rumors and show you some of the many reasons owning a Poodle dog breed is a great choice. Of all dog breeds, the Poodle is rated as one of the most intelligent. Because of this, both training and teaching a dog of this type, tricks could not be easier or more enjoyable. Originally, the Poodle dog breed came from Germany although, at that time, the only size was the standard Poodle. Now there is also the choice of miniature and toy. There are three sizes of Poodles to include. The Poodle dog breed actually dates back as far as the 15th century at which time it was called a Pudel. Initially and even today, this breed is considered and registered as a sporting dog because of its ability to not only hunt but also swim. While there is some debate as to what breeds were mixed to ultimately create the Poodle, most experts believe this dog was the result of crossing the Water Spaniel with different Russian breeds. One of the most interesting facts about the Poodle is that France named it the National Dog, giving it the new name Poodle, which translates to splash in water. While it is rare in the United States to see people using the Poodle as a retriever for duck hunting and other water activities, the truth is that this breed does an exceptional job, even better than any other retrieving breed. For people who show Poodles, cuts are quite extravagant but in the early years, the only reason the Poodle was clipped was to make it more buoyant in the water. Because the standard Poodle is a large dog and due to growing demand for the same character and physical traits but in a smaller form, breeding was able to produce both the miniature and toy varieties. Price Standard Poodle breeders have a range of prices. For example, in the USA you can expect to spend anything from $1,500 to $3,000 on a puppy from health-tested parents. On the other hand, in the UK, the average standard poodle ranges from £850 to £1,200. If you enjoy this video don't forget to like and share and please remember to subscribe to our channel. Pros of the Poodle Dog Breed The list of positive attributes associated with the Poodle Dog Breed is quite long. Poodle Temperament Standard Poodles tend to be active, intelligent dogs. Whilst they have a reputation for being aloof, this is more a calm reserve with strangers. They are very loving and loyal to members of their family. This quiet reserve also means that they are likely to be less distracted by other people when you want them to focus. Additionally, they can be a sensitive dog, who will cringe or cower if you raise your voice to them. Thus, she is best handled gently, reflecting her own soft and adorable nature. Poodle Appearance Standard Poodles are well-proportioned dogs. That is, they are tall with even legs and backs, and a proud stature. Their eyes are dark ovals, and their ears hang close to their heads. Their skulls are rounded, but with defined flat cheekbones. Overall, they give the impression of elegance and grace. A Poodle's Coat Their coats come in two different types, curly or corded. On one hand, the curly poodle coat is harsh and dense all over, with an even spread of fur. On the other hand, the corded standard poodle has a coat of tight cords. They also have longer fur on their heads and bodies, but shorter on their ankles. While this may not matter to everyone, it is nice to have a wide selection when it comes to color. For instance, the poodle comes in solid colors of white, gray, black, brown, apricot, cream, silver, and cafe au lait. You would also find what are called party poodles, which have a combination of more than one color. Now, if you simply want an amazing family pet or companion, a party poodle would be fine but if your intention were to show or breed the dog, AKC sees this color combination as a flaw. Because of this, a party poodle would be disqualified from being shown but also, this type of poodle could never be registered nor could puppies born to her. Another benefit of choosing a poodle dog breed is the temperament. Most often, especially after being groomed, this breed possesses an air of arrogance but when it comes to personality and behavior, it passes all tests. This dog is excellent with children, regardless of age, does everything possible to please its owner, is loving and affectionate, 
and gets along incredibly well with other animals if introduced while young. Lifespan The average standard poodle lifespan is around 12 years. They have shorter lifespans than their miniature counterparts, who live on average 14 years. Cons of a poodle dog breed Typically, grooming needs would be considered unimportant but since haircuts would be required every 5 to 6 weeks, you want to keep in mind the added expense. Additionally, while not negative for everyone, the poodle requires exercise so unless you have a fenced backyard or someone in the family who would be willing to provide daily walks and playtime, the poodle may not be the right choice. On the other hand, if the activity needs of this breed could be met then this would not be an issue. Barking Despite this quiet nature, standard poodles can be fans of their own voices. They tend to alert you to visitors, which is a trait that some families appreciate. If you are not a fan of barking, then make sure to never react to your dog woofing. Also, the click for quiet technique can be very effective in reducing a noisy dog's barking. You can find out more about training your standard poodle puppy in the link below. The last consideration that could be seen as a con is that unfortunately, the poodle dog breed is susceptible to a number of health problems broken down by the specific variety as shown below. Standard Poodle the standard poodle would be at risk for sebaceous adenitis, Addison's disease, hip dysplasia, epilepsy, progressive retinal atrophy, von Willebrandt's disease, and hypothyroidism. Miniature Poodle For this size poodle, health risks would include hip dysplasia, progressive retinal atrophy, patella subluxation, epilepsy, hypothyroidism, cryptorchidism, and leg calf perths. Toy Poodle this size would face the same risks as the miniature poodle with the exception of hip dysplasia. Is a poodle a good fit for you? Like all dog breeds, poodles can be a fantastic choice for a pet but only for the right person. If you are elderly or pretty immobile or inactive, then a poodle would be a disastrous choice. If you want a dog who is medium to large, combining sturdiness and athleticism with elegance and grace has a short curly coat that is virtually non-shedding, poodles of any size are the best dog breed for people with allergies. Comes in a variety of colors. Is lively and playful. Is one of the brightest and most attentive of all breeds, such a skilled reader of body language and expression, that he often appears telepathic. Is easy to train and housebreak. Is usually polite with strangers and sociable with other animals. A standard poodle may be right for you. If you don't want to deal with a careful search to avoid the high-strung lines, vigorous exercise requirements, exuberant jumping, romping, and bounding about, especially when young, skittishness in some lines, or when not socialized enough, emotional sensitivity to stress, tension, and loud voices, clipping the curly coat every six weeks, barking, Serious potential health issues. A standard poodle may not be right for you.